Absolutely. You know, we played them last year. Uh, they were both very tough, and obviously they they progressed. And uh, you know, they're very talented, high energy guys. And, you know, Sacre is really big, uh, very strong, and Harris. You know, he, he he's a very good player as well. Um, it'll be a good matchup for myself as well as the other bigs. Um, you know, we're going to start preparing for him today, and uh, you know, see what we can do. Yeah, absolutely. You know, I've gone against a lot of the a lot of the top big guys in the country. You know, either through uh, AAU basketball, but it's, it's not the same. And then, it, you know, I played against uh, Jonas Valachunas, who was like the number five pick in the draft over the summer when I played for USA Basketball. So, you know, I've had some matchups that were, uh, you know, against some pretty good big guys. But uh, you know, it'll be it'll be a tough matchup for uh, for us on Sunday, so or Saturday. So we should we'll see what happens. How different are you now? Uh, I would say I'm further along than what I was. You know, I made that big jump um, after last year in, into the summer, and then, you know, I feel like I've made another step, uh, you know, progressing my offensive game, you know. Uh, as far as, like, my conditioning and all that kind of stuff goes, I'm pretty even kills compared to what I was, but I feel like I'm a little further along uh, offensively, and then everything else is pretty much the same. You saw the high-low, a little bit of high-low the other night. Is that, is that timing? Is that... What makes that work? Uh, you know, we actually s start off most practices by doing some stuff like that, um, trying to trying to figure out you know different ways to get the ball inside, you know, either to me or some of the other bigs. Um, you know, we, like I said, we do drills to work on it, and you know, obviously it's different in live action, but I feel like um, it, it can work because you know if they start if they start playing me uh, too hard on the first pass, making it hard for the first post entry, you can just skip it and you know, go high low and all that kind of stuff. So it gives us more options. Bruce said, uh, he's got to remind you sometimes you're one of the options on offense. Uh, is that a little different for you to be kind of starting to become a focal point of the offense? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I feel like um, even just kind of knowing for myself that, you know, I have to do things on the offensive end, which, you know, I'm, I'm comfortable with doing. Um, you know, even if I get the ball, you know, a couple times this year, I've, you know, kicked it out to Sam, found other guys, and I, I think that I'm a fairly good passer, so, you know, I'm, I'm able to find people out of the post. Um, but I, I, I have come to realize that, that, you know, I have to be a focal point of the offense and, uh, you know, really control the game and control the paint. Do you mind that? No, not at all. You know, I uh, feel like I'm very capable of doing that uh, night in and night out. You know, obviously I'll have, you know, some off games, miss some shots, but, you know, that's, that's normal. Do you expect Sacker to try to overpower you or expect it to be a battle on the blocks? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I, I, think, uh, I think it's going to be a battle. There's no doubt about that. You know, he's big and strong. And, you know, I'm willing to bang in the post, so, uh, you know, we'll see what happens, but I'm certainly not going to back down, and I don't think he will either, so it'll be a good matchup.